we we don't know how it's going to go yet we've played together before a little bit but this is quite new we've never um mixed these poems with uh music before um the poet that i've been translating is sappho who is a greek poet uh, from the island of lesbos writing around 600 bc um very little of her poetry exists in uh in the original language in ancient greek um and what does exist is usually in fragments i think there is one complete poem so my translations except for one are all fragments um just to give you an idea of the work this is a facsimile of some of her writing in the ancient greek in a really beautiful edition uh, that's the only complete poem we have as you can see it's quite short so all the poems will be quite short and they will be accompanied by harp um and we'll see what happens so yeah thank you for being here and um let's see what happens is the sound okay is everything it's good you've also been joined by a pigeon like um, a pigeon has kind of flown in to and lands on the yeah, harp this is, this, is this, is, uh, this is my pet pigeon and ties by poetry. <laughs> Amazing. That's really great. Well, he lives here. He's, he's a friend. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. So these are poems of Sappho. for me, make us a bedroom, a tussle of thoughts, apple trees, and I'm practically begging you, burning sequoia sap, steep in the water as it falls, winnows my surrendered body, into the branches and brackets, arms, walnuts and worms, invisible sheets, a tiny catastrophe bedroom in your mouth till sleep steals me again. A pony calls from the garden. I'm gently upset. Come now with your guilt and fear oppressed as I'm stuck between the doors, golden falling around the floor like a bad, bad dog. For if you stay away, I know that I must die. Some miraculous innocuous nectar for regular maintenance smacking. It has destroyed my mind. It's over. Now that I am dead is all that is left. And now that you are dead, demolished, nobody screams your name into the burning wind, the blushing flames torn from birth, eyeless in the sight of Hikati, you wander among the listless dead, eyeless, eyeless, a ghost of your own rendition. Or you know who you are. You died in your mouth. It opened, filled with your enemies. They floated there, killed you. Now you are dead. Nobody says your name. Everything is wrong. We've already won. Now my beautiful family, imps basking in lyric fields. The song is over, 
it's almost dawn or dusk or midday or some time or an exact time or no time at all it is almost day and to gently kiss your ghost in a mouse piwaki is equal with the gods that man the gloats its eyes trained to rest who robs the whole perimeter he listens to your strobing heart and pins your breath inside the throat you the ribbing stretched and tugged as dust glass so in century when i see you glitch again oh repentant rest upon the knee my tongue, sublime to vapour, burns soft fire in the flesh that rips and flattens to the taste and knits the aching thunder in my bones. Dead in the wasting sorrow of heat, freeze-dried to the skin, I am cast to the parched grey lawns, a square inch short of death set in. around the beautiful moon. The cosmos shrines the empty moon, invisible, the ground covered in second light, empty. He is dying, Cytheria, your tender Adonis. The billionaire is fading. Never mind, we'll get another. He's only 96. What is appropriate? Drowning in tears. Seventeen. Mummy, I've wrecked my job. May I have a pony, boy? Or... I am destroyed by work. Never work. Or... Mother, I have been evacuated bloody hands. I am filled with desiccated love. Caves shudder, a noxious pulse. That is natural loss. Love makes me scatter, the earth's fall, all this endlessly, to voice is a decree against the numbing watch of the moon. Aspects opposed, but his face it starts at lower border, controls nothing, has drinking. Walls approach climax, kill me. I forget Blumenkraft. Eyes, violent order and remain orbiting clarity. I hope for nothing to come is the sky. Man stares at the sky and the sky stares at man.
I climbed into the sky today, and all today's the sky kills so lovely body and hands. No slipping contrast, love robbed my heart. There in the sky, snapping over the brutal, guarding their land. Spare me, oh, shake not my, shake our sky's heart. Past times. We'd array your voice and line would rush in tandem to a billion throats that crack in the sky. You have climbed my heart, screeching in the air. His erudite golden sanctum. The tether, not erudite, pinion, arrayed in extremities of shame. The ground here is a clubbing blade, the bustling figure dallying for the skies to end. What has become, yet demean your soiled, shed skin, shed shamed? You asked, come and awash, a vast, sentimental of swirling in the through space. Love and billions running after as behind, retracting as you flood. It is a choiceless, unforgiven flag. The will that stretches in your back. I would call out the dancing plague. Ring each hand in total sub billion, array to sky crack, voices and throats be retracted and a flooding also promise. <coughs> I saw a person pressed as stars, a species pressed vitro, stars, the rope covered in silver light, foul, unceasing flotsam. Fragment 29. Mentu within, pin poppies to my skin, my teacher. Violent and featureful, our enemies are non non. You turn away with me. Stop your external force, tears, stop your outwards. Oh fucking Aphrodite, I saw the filthy sunworm turning, allied with our wounds, then it snivelled back to love and no, I hated it not my head, it radiates and sucks. Again, twist. Engineers, wail your excuses, concussing teenage daughter, and it's all your fault. Twenty for echo. Discord, the blast mirror. Your cheek feels mine in the dark. Play out your soul as if bolted. Open mouth, mouth open, left your skin. 
When you laugh in temporal drag, Jackie, on my flat chest, it gurgles your head, the bruising sun, my speech is all but done. Body glossolalia, underfloor heating, sensory bridges smashed off, tinnitus and wind, herbs laid over crystals on spin cycle drag, animation, needy palpitation makes me sick, standing by the fear door, bowing like the grass, like my hair, like what it cannot mean. Pale yellow or brilliant green, it's yours, darling one. Temporal drag me back by living icon. Always, always living. Fragment 31. Wish I'd worked harder, things are flat, the order, the body arrayed to loss, shocks bolt by what? Staring at the fears or beige, she is stitching my hair to the eyes black in alarm bays for a bucket of glue. The tears has never yet yet, I will echo in hell, I will, I will love my enemies. Focus their trembling wrists, hold their wrists, hair fanning out my right flat chest. Fragment 32. And remove the breathing tube. Hold your tears. Wasp. Restless wasp. Attached to sinkhole. Language at the fear door. Quick to anger. Morning slips. How many more, Sappho, as they tear me out? So I chalice. I cascade and shot back. Feed our love out to these vampires. Can only taste your skin. And hold the discord how we dress together, woven violent skin and flame. Our collars, chains, branch, branch, and neck rub. Come to name, name to come. Gildas forever, total jet. Some resin. You were soaked in chaos, roses. With resin, vampires, I can see a new life, corpse, that was not yours to have, they lied, lay it there. This poem is called Moon Poem, and the first is a literal translation of the poem, and slowly it falls to pieces. The moon has set, and the Pleiades, it is midnight, the time is going by, and I recline alone. Darkness, even Mazarin dots, no bearing in time, bodies empty, I entropy night after night. Twenty-seven stars, Hecate's crumbling skin. I long to haul its body. The moon is terrifying silence. No dogs in the Pleiades. I've been in solitude. We slept. I lay alone, stars dead, or so it seemed, night contracted. The moon has set, and the Pleiades, the time is going by me at midnight. No, no, no. Wings in season, under the blood moon, circumstances, happiness, poison myself again. Chill and blush reflect the cold, no warm light of the sky. Thank you.
My beloved sister, it was futile chase given an understanding of waste. Its neck hung up from the heaving beams, its arms stuck, it dreams of this happening now. Aberrant, my loss of nerve returned, how in disgust you howl from those you blankly won't discern. How moral is the buglier, the scent that takes my heart against the sky's magenta blush to sing your gorgeous dance. Fragment 34. To die is a given of order, redeemed to die, or death understood, terminus, totality, or terminal. She saw a spider, its egg sac hung, what's to be done? He's mm, a crackling yellow stream, like a weapon sculpture, or what is at stake? My words mean nothing, you are. Fragment 17. There was a very selfish child who ate its sibling's birthday bun. When they saw what it had done, its parents sought to reconcile. Darling, here's your bun wrapped neat inside your sibling's paper frame. Tear from it your prize contained inside this gloating sip uh, parcel's meat. He even ripped the child did until the sibling fell apart to eke out what the entrails hid, the bun that cost the child its heart. Moral subjects void your doubt or selfishness will live in you until somebody rips it out and makes all of your dreams come true. Their names were Illa Mauser and Piwakit. The last fragment, fragment three. My voice to you. Our voice's rendition. Ours. I'll be gone soon, so for now, this song for you forever, she said. And it is over. And it ends. Wow, thank you so much. Brilliant, thank you. That's absolutely fantastic. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm just going to stop the recording so um, the students uh, can ask questions without feeling self-conscious. I'm just going to stop that right now. Here we go. Um.